wins in five. His head coach was former champion Jens Culver, one of the most entertaining fighters to ever battle in the UFC. The ultimate fighter winner, Nate Diaz. Nate Diaz is a very accomplished submission artist, and he earned his way into the UFC by finishing all four of his fights in the Ultimate Fighter Season 5. Since then, he's put together some impressive victories and really improved his boxing. Dustin Boyer, ready to go to battle, put on a show. This guy has some of the best takedown defense we've ever seen inside the octagon. His timing and his utilization of underhooks and sprawl are world class. Dustin Boyan set to go to bat with Nate Diaz. take for this lightweight fight. Poye is 27. Diaz is 30. He will have a four-inch reach advantage. Once again, here's the veteran voice of the octagon, Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC. Lightweight division. Introducing first, fighting at the new corner. A jiu-jitsu fighter. Holding a professional record of 20 wins, 11 losses. He stands six feet tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting out of Stockton, California. Ladies and gentlemen, he is an ultimate fighter and season winner. Nate Diaz! And now this is his opponent. Fighting out of the red corner. This man is an ex martial artist, holding a professional record of. 20 wins, four losses. He stands five feet nine inches tall, weighing in at 155 pounds. Fighting at a coconut creek, Pelota, the stand, the tiger, And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. Dan Mergliata, our referee. Are uh, you ready? You ready? And go, here go. we go. It's the South Pole versus the South Pole. White trunks for Diaz, black trunks for Poirier. You know, Joe, in talking to Nate Diaz after his past couple of fights, it seems as he gets older, it is becoming more and more difficult for him to cut to 155. I believe it is, Mike. He's a very tall guy for that weight class, and he's growing. He's very young, and I think staying at 155 might eventually be detrimental to his career. Oh, nice. That left misses. Good clinch. And they break free. Man, that was a perfect counter punch. He's looking for that right hand, Mike. Man, this guy loves to slip and rip. Good combination on the counter. Yep. Oh, he had him. Looking to finish it. Oh, look at this. Who saw that coming? Caught him with it. Punch. Oh, wow! That's oh, it, he's out, he's out! Just wow. like that! Beautiful knockout here, early in the first. Time now for our fight replay. And here in the replay, we see this huge left hand landing for the knockout. Let's take a look at that again here. Here it is one more time. Boom! And he's out. And now here's Bruce Buffer with the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Bergliana has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 21 seconds of the very first round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Nate Diaz! Nate Diaz! 
victorious with the knockout.